Chapter 193 and 194 The massive roots of the divine tree trembled incessantly, then ripped themselves from the ground. The sensation was akin to all our pores being pierced by needles, an indescribable pain. This was a characteristic of evolution, the restructuring of cells. This time, the divine tree was not evolving, but merely transforming a part of its body, adding another eye. So the rate of change seemed faster. The divine tree opened its enormous mouth and continued to roar endlessly, echoing in every corner of Misty Mountain. All creatures trembled in fear. Of course, no beast dared to think that their master was being attacked and thus screaming. A few minutes later, an avatar from the roots of the divine tree had finished forming, standing silently on the ground. The space was densely covered with spiritual energy like never before. From this angle, it seemed like a rhinoceros. Unable to hold back, the rhinoceros panted and complained. Damn it, it hurts so much. However, the third eye was only slightly open at this time. Suddenly, a purple lightning bolt struck down from the sky, aiming straight at the third eye and hitting it with a destructive force. The divine tree braced itself, knowing that this lightning bolt was the one that would fully open the eye of the sky, so it had to absorb all of its power. It was clearly daytime, but the space had darkened, the light was only concentrated where the lightning bolt was striking, lasting for several minutes. How much energy was absorbed to serve the process of opening this third eye? Only heaven knows. The process ended, the third eye inside had started to change color, then forcefully opened wide, a blood-red eye, very strange. Indeed, when this eye was added to the divine tree, it changed, even the color was not the same as the three-eyed tribe. The divine tree panted heavily, unexpectedly more tired than fighting with a lover. Why so? The divine tree never had a girlfriend? It doesn't matter, it's just a metaphor. Look at this, a third-eye version of the divine tree, with a blood-red pupil, four circles enveloping each other, and seven mysterious seals around it. Behind it is the cosmic void. You know, right? It looks a lot like the matured Sharingan. Perhaps the key point is those seven mysterious seals. In Eastern culture, the number seven is the most powerful, symbolizing everything. It seems that this time the divine tree has harvested a VIP item. At this time, the sky and the earth had returned to clarity. No, returned to a foggy day. The golden monkeys seeing this scene could only sigh. The master has finally opened the heavenly eye. Of course, they were still trembling sweat pouring out like streams. This is probably a natural reflex in front of an entity that has become stronger than common sense. The body involuntarily generates fear and caution. This body of the divine tree looked really miserable. The heart core had cracked. Indeed, opening the heavenly eye was not as easy as the divine tree thought, consuming more than half of all spiritual power, and also had to endure the punishment of nature. Nature, when detecting development beyond the rules of the universe, will strike down extremely strong lightning to eliminate, ensuring balance in all things and maintaining the law of biochemistry. So, that's why the heart core of the divine tree was beaten to crack all over. But it doesn't matter, the greedy eyes of the divine tree lit up brightly, because now the third eye had been successfully opened. Just looking at it, you know it's a good item. Not only that, around it, there appeared sparkling particles floating in the air. The divine tree stared in fascination. Perhaps when someone is handsome, these sparkling particles will appear, right? It could also be that this is just the light system's spiritual power escaping. The divine tree looked up at the sky. The sky had never sparkled like this, of course. It's not because the sky has also become handsome, but because of the ability to open and see through everything. The divine tree could now observe all kinds of different spiritual powers, and they are distinguished by color. But no matter what, the divine tree just stood there stunned. How does it feel, like a colorblind child? Wearing a pair of glasses that help see color? So the child just stood there unresponsive, in his head only an indescribable feeling of fascination. Enough. The divine tree retracted its roots. It decided to return to its original form and start careful research. Of course, an item that looks complicated like this, surely the way to use it is not simple. The divine tree used a root to observe itself. Oh my, this eye is really big, and the deep red is too prominent. The divine tree approached and observed carefully, 
discovering seven magatama seals inside. For a moment, it was not clear what its function was, hmm. Then open the user manual. An information screen was turned on. Let's see. Eyes of the sky. The seven realms of heaven. Possessing the space of earth, the space of fire, the space of ice, the space of thunder, the space of void, the space of vitality, and the space of light. Note. Each space can grow until it becomes a world. After reading, the divine tree jumped up, couldn't believe it. The heavenly eye contained such a large spatial power. The divine tree excitedly shouted, Space. Where's the space? Why can't I see it? Hmm. Look carefully then maybe corresponding to the seven magatama is the seven spaces. Indeed, when injecting spiritual power to feel, the divine tree had felt the exact corresponding elemental spiritual powers. Green will be the space element of ice. Brown is earth. Red is fire. Green leaf is life. White is light. Purple is void space. Yellow is thunder. The divine tree is super smart, finally understood. He always feared the system would cheat him. But the problem is, how can these spaces be used? Propping his chin and thinking, the divine tree might have to use the method of elimination. If this is an active skill, then there must be a mantra or something to activate. But what if it's passive? Suddenly the fire system Magatama moved to the center and became larger. What did the divine tree do? Then a gate leading to the fire space appeared in front of the divine tree. What's inside? Of course, nothing except for blazing fire. The divine tree was also startled. Didn't understand what happened? Look carefully then there's no harm to its owner. The divine tree decided to check, put an arm in and groped, determined that this space is still too small. Only about 10 meters the divine tree looked into it with a bit of disappointment. What can this 10 meters do? For the divine tree, it can only be considered as a bag. The good thing is that these spaces can expand, even become a world, due to the previous punishment of nature. The divine tree had absorbed quite a lot of lightning into the heavenly eye. The system notified that the thunder space had grown to thousands of square meters. Now the divine tree just needs to fill these seven spaces, then we'll calculate further. No matter what, the divine tree was still a bit excited in his heart, as if being granted the title divine tree of the seven worlds by nature can consider himself just got promoted from branch manager to chairman of the board. Over here, the nine-tailed fox has also completed her evolution process. Her fiery tails have become sharper and more radiant than ever before. How many tails does she have now? If I'm not mistaken, it's four. The last time the Moon Wolf King saw five tails, it was probably an illusion created by Susanu. The nine tails joyfully approached to congratulate her master, you finally opened the heavenly eye. The divine tree, being busy, only responded indifferently. Oh, have you completed your evolution? The nine tails evolution this time did not elevate her to the fourth order, but to the final stage of the third order peak. However, her momentum and strength have been greatly enhanced. In the eyes of the divine tree at this moment, the strength of the nine tails is a purple white color. Looking back at this beloved junior, the divine tree silently sighed in his heart. Indeed, the nine tails of the fox tribe possesses an astonishing growth rate. If the tide of spiritual power comes, the nine tails will surely reach the transcendent fourth order. The divine tree suddenly had an idea. Nine tails, spit fire at me. The fox thought she had misheard. What? But the divine tree insisted. Just do as I say. Hurry up. Immediately after. The loyal Nine Tails used the skill, Fire Spit, spewing a burning breath onto the face of the Divine Tree. Over here, the Divine Tree opened the fire space and absorbed all the flames of the Nine Tails. Intelligent, indeed intelligent. Seeing this scene, the Fox was also surprised. Her flames had been completely absorbed. The Divine Tree was pleased and opened the system panel. Ha ha ha, indeed. Whatever you absorb, that space will grow. Now the system has expanded the space by an additional three square meters. The nine tails saw that her master didn't care about her and thought that her attack was too weak. She then burst out with spiritual power. Her whole body turned into a destructive flame, as radiant as the sun. Master, if it's still not enough, then... Before she could finish her sentence, the nine tails fired the flame. This flame was several times larger than the previous one. The divine tree felt his face heating up, just unconsciously looked over. Oh my, nine tails, what are you doing? 
Look at this. The flame has filled the mouth of the divine tree. The push force is so strong that the whole body of the divine tree is shaking rustlingly. This time, it certainly can't eat all. The Nine Tails was scared at this moment and shouted the name of the divine tree. Sweating like rain, manslaughter also has to go to jail. It's not a joke. The divine tree poked out of the flame. The heart core had been slightly burned, grumbled and complained. It hurts so much. What are you doing? The system screen immediately displayed a warning. The fire space is about to explode. The divine tree frowned and looked. There was a bit of loss in his eyes, like a scientist who just ruined the last experiment. So if you absorb too much direct elements like this, it will lead to space overload and collapse. So this smart method of his can't be used. Have to go back to the long-term plan, that is, absorb with spirit stones. In the Flower Valley and Misty Mountain, ah, uh, there was none before. It was only built recently. Look at this, countless flowers of various colors, shining brightly, making this flower feel like a paradise on earth, too beautiful, too fragrant, too, too captivating. The night wind blew through the field, bringing with it countless divine fragrances. The beasts here rumored that just by smelling it, it can increase strength and invigorate the spirit. Why so? So it's like marijuana? No problem, this stuff is not addictive. This place is also a place that produces countless precious materials, spiritual herbs, spiritual flowers, all kinds of levels. Who is the manager of this land? Of course, it's the flower goddess. She has been in charge of planting medicinal herbs since the early days of coming here, because at that time, the divine tree discovered her ability to radiate life energy in space, helping all things achieve extremely fast growth. The flower goddess and the butterfly were standing in front of a blooming flower. They sighed and looked, didn't expect this precious flower has successfully bloomed. The butterfly modestly gave all the credit to the flower goddess, but the flower goddess also gave all the credit to the butterfly. Ah, where did this butterfly come from? She was brought back by the Nine Tails from a field within about ten episodes ago. The two girls refused to take credit for themselves, then they burst into laughter. Hick, I don't know why I find their laughter so fake. Just at this moment, the Divine Tree came. Today he came to inspect the work here a bit. A big black head with an additional blood-red eye appeared, unconsciously scared the two of them. They ran away from the monster, even didn't have time to pick up their slippers. A minute later they came back. The whole field was not a blade of grass, the flower goddess regretted and said, Is there anything cleaner than this field? The butterfly next to her just sighed heavily. I don't want to work hard anymore. Thought the master came to ask about the health of his employees. Didn't expect a harvest all at once. It's too much. The divine tree has returned to his place. A root can also carry the heavenly eye. Indeed this treasure is very convenient to use. After eating all the spiritual medicine in the Garden of the Flower Goddess, the Divine Tree opened the system panel and checked. Indeed, the life space has increased to 1,000 square meters. Now the Divine Tree can build a mansion inside it. Suddenly a white furry foot appeared. Hmm, it's the tribe leader of the Snow Bear. The Divine Tree saw it and doubted. Big Bear, you're not guarding the northern border. What are you doing here? The Big Bear was not good at speaking. He was a tribe with a very proud and stubborn heart. He was originally an ally, not a subordinate of the divine tree. Today he came, brought a piece of news that he heard from the mutant whale to the divine tree, a piece of news related to the seabed. Hearing this, the divine tree was startled. News about the seabed? You have to know that this sea is very related to the dark. Last time the whale prophet was the messenger of the dark, organized a large-scale invasion of the land. Is this the mutant crocodile? He is coming at the summons of the divine tree. Just after a while, all the main force of Misty Mountain had gathered under the feet of the divine tree. The divine tree looked at the army, only missing the white tiger and Tion Cam. The two of them are currently managing work in Fire City. The rest have all arrived. At this time, Long Fong crossed his arms, spoke solemnly, the seven kings of the sea have united their forces and simultaneously attacked the land, aiming to dominate the world. We can't forgive them. And the Nine Tails said, If we don't let them go, the war with the sea tribe will happen. How will we fight? The elephant demon over here gave an opinion. Now it's hard to evaluate the strength of Misty Mountain and the sea. Don't know which one is stronger. 
because we have too little information about them. Cheesy spoke up, according to information from my girlfriend, humans have given up invading and exploring the sea three years ago, but the sea tribe has invaded the land and has been stopped is an undeniable fact. The golden ant solemnly said, according to the information I received when I was in Australia, in addition to the seven kings, the sea tribe has many other tribes, their strength is also very strong, perhaps we can ally with them. The earth person Ching Chong heard everyone speak and also joined in a panic. Master, three years ago, even though the sea tribe invaded the land, they did not cause any damage to us, can we not wage war with them? Ah, so they are discussing whether to declare war on the sea? Of course, the juniors of the divine tree don't know the deep reasons behind this. They don't know that this sea tribe is being manipulated by the dark and acting according to the will of the dark, don't know at this time. How far the sea has been infiltrated by the dark. The divine tree spoke sternly and decisively. No, they are our enemies. It was then that the divine tree revealed the truth, its eyes becoming serious, a hint of discomfort in its voice. You don't know something? Three years ago, they were targeting me. They knew about me. Although the seven kings of the sea are very powerful, the remaining sea tribes are not weak either. If they can unite, they will create a formidable force. But the first step is still to inspect the situation. The divine tree needs to know the temperament of these sea beasts, how many sea tribes are submissive, how many are neutral, and how many are resistant. So, the divine tree looked at Chi Zi, I will assign you the task of surveying this situation. After all, you can walk on the sea, try to communicate with the inhabitants of the sea. Chi Zi immediately accepted the task. The divine tree now needs to concentrate all its efforts to find more allies, because in about 15 days, the tide of spiritual power will erupt, and any additional tribe that can be scraped up will be better. Switch to a frozen ocean deep in the north of the earth. It's completely desolate and cold. A solitary ice road connects Misty Mountain and this place. Of course, this road was created by Chi Zi, who was trudging along, walking and panting heavily, Estimated to have walked tens of kilometers cheesy now just wants to have Doryman's time machine. So when the divine tree assigns a task, he will say that he has a stomachache and refuse, of course. He could also be beaten by the divine tree until his head swells into a pig's head. Suddenly there was a large movement on the sea surface. Cheesy instinctively looked in that direction with caution. A five-headed snake and a mutant whale appeared. Both had evolved to the transcendent third order. The panda raised his fist in anger and said, I've walked hundreds of miles just to meet you guys. The whale heard this and explained in distress, We are also busy looking for information about the tribes, and most of the sea area is under the close watch of the Seven Kings. Only this sea branch is safe. Hearing this, Cheesy covered his mouth and said in a secretive manner, Is that so? Then it's time for us to start an unlimited secret conversation. Cheesy looked at the five-headed snake and said cheerfully, Oh my, you've grown so fast. The five-headed snake with five heads all answered in unison. There were only three heads before, he he. If you still remember, this five-headed snake was almost captured by the Sakura nation before. Then Cheesy spread his arms and began to declare the words of the divine tree verbatim. I want you to unite the remaining sea tribes and fight against the seven sea kings. The dolphin opened its mouth in astonishment. So the divine tree has decided to wage war? It really doesn't look like the divine tree of the past. Only when pushed to the end would it wage war. Cheesy also wilted. He himself was warlike but only solo. He didn't like war. Cheesy said sadly, Yes, if war breaks out, your orca tribe will be the vanguard, casualties will surely be the most. On the contrary, the whale heard this and was silent for a second then happily replied, I understand. For the whale, war is inevitable. It's just this force versus that force. If the divine tree doesn't wage war, then the sea itself would have waged war with each other. That's the reality of so many years. But this time with the domineering divine tree as a backing, the whale is confident that it can negotiate with other sea tribes, believing that they will also stand on the side of the divine tree. The whale and the five-headed snake left, not forgetting to greet Chi Zi. Cheesy was stunned. There was a touch of emotion in his heart for the loyalty of the whale, but also a feeling of unease rose. Sweat suddenly flowed out. Cheesy couldn't help but shout. The dolphin turned around and looked. What? Ah, uh, nothing. The
the dolphin and the snake glided away, their backs gradually disappearing in front of Chi Zi. Chi Zi wanted to wish them a safe journey, but would that be unlucky? Chi Zi had to whisper this blessing. Only he himself could hear it. War for Chi Zi? It's really a piece of sorrow. After the battle with Australith, Chi Zi then saw countless people die. Even he himself faced death closer than ever before, and now, Chi Zi in his deep heart has had many changes, stronger, more powerful but also calmer, and especially cherishes peace. End of chapter 194